Bwana Yesu asifiwe. <coughs> I'm at my lowest point in my life. But before I talk about Marie, I have something to say. I would not be here standing strong if it were not for my support system. <clears throat> my family has seen a lot of deaths this year. And I'm so sorry to my mother because in January my sister lost her daughter who was 17. In July, June, we buried my brother. And last week on Sunday, we buried my father's brother. And today we are burying my daughter. But I want to give some gratitude too. Because this is the only chance I have. And it has taken me a lot for me to stand here. my family and friends from Nairobi I do not take you for granted. You made sure my home was very warm despite me being at my weakest. I could just feel like screaming but when I look at my mom I'm trying to get some strength. And to Father thank you so much Baba. Thank you so much for your prayers and encouragement. My sister Judy, you have worked with me. <laughs> Betty, thank you. You have worked with me. You gave me the courage to go and see Maria the Mok because I had refused to go. Anna, thank you so much. And Emo, Liz, Georgia, you guys are still family to me. You've stood by me. Black, thank you so much for giving me Mary. And thank you so much for encouraging me every single day. Because I am heartbroken. It is painful, a pain that I cannot even take Panadol for. And to my son, Ethan, Ethan, you encouraged me, but I'm sorry, Baba, today I have to break down. All of you people, I am the family. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Bila nyinyi singe kwa nimesima mapa na izingu kumuna jwa wile nimekua. Marafiki zangu wa Nairobi, sijui kenyaneza wapatia. Na bado msima mea. Mario was my my only daughter. <laughs> I was just a child when I gave birth to her. She was 